to manage Jamfat account, go to GL Account Maintenance. During the creation of this account book, I have asked the system to generate sample chart for the account. So this is the chart of account generated by the system. By default, the checkbox of show all accounts is checked to display all accounts in the chart. Uncheck this checkbox if you would like to view only the selected account type. On the left panel, there are buttons to create new former account, create new special account, edit and delete account, print chart of account, and close the account maintenance windows. Items with beige background color are account types. Standard account types are auto-generated by the system. You may add new account types. Add general maintenance, account type maintenance. Those in Light blue background colors are special accounts. Special accounts are created using these six special account buttons. In AutoCount Accounting, you may create unlimited level of accounts, but none of these special accounts should carry child account because only normal accounts can be selected as parent account. Those accounts with white background color are normal accounts. Normal accounts are created using this button, New Normal Account. All normal accounts can be parent accounts, but those that carry child account will not carry any transaction. The up to date balance will show the balance amount as at this date, the up to date date. Obviously, my accounts are all empty. Back to my chart of account, I'm going to modify this chart of account. As for account code format, it was defined during account book creation, but you can redefine it at tools, options, general, account code format. You may change the account code format anytime, but earlier created account code will remain. You can also use free format. It is advisable to structure your chart of account in a way that is easy to search and according to reporting needs. To create a normal account, click to highlight the account type, let's say expenses, or another normal account. Then click on new normal account. Parent account, by default, the system will take the account that carries no balance that you have highlighted, else the account type will be selected. Key in the account number, let's say 9040EPF, tab, and the description is EPF contribution by employer. Click on add to add another account. Let's say 9040SOC, SOXO contribution by employer. Then click on save. As you can see, two accounts have been added. To create a pair of fixed set account, Together with this accumulated depreciation account, click on the button of Fix Asset. For Fix Asset account, put in the account number 2005000 and description Computer and ICT. Press Tab. The accumulated depreciation account description is already filled and just key in the account number 2005005 and click on Save. You have saved two accounts at the same time. You can drag the account and put under fixed assets. Yes. Similarly to another one. And yes. For fixed assets, you can go to others, maintain fixed assets links to view the relationship or link of each fixed asset account and its respective accumulated depreciation account. You can modify the link to add or remove the link if it's necessary. Bank cash and deposit account is used to create accounts that involve payment methods. Define either it is a bank, cash or deposit account under account tab of current assets or current liability. Key in the account number Define the cash flow category 
This is for cash flow reports. Key in the description, main bank Berhad. And assign a payment method, main bank Berhad, check. Select the general type. Specify a bank charges account for this payment method if it is likely to involve bank charges. Merge bank charges in bank reconciliation transaction. Check this checkbox so that bank charges will be added or merged with payment or received amount in bank reconciliation listing. Otherwise, bank charges will be displayed as a separate item. Need to specify additional information such as check number or credit card number. When this is checked, message will be prompted if check number or credit card number was not entered during transaction. However, it does not prevent you from saving the transaction. Payment document and receipt document running format. Select a payment voucher and official receipt document numbering format that you have maintained at general maintenance or else the default format will be used. You may click on add payment method to add several payment methods under this account. And be aware that the deposit account is needed for entries in AR or AP deposit and AR or AP refund. And also each of these type of accounts may have more than one payment method, but the name of payment method must be unique. Examples of payment methods for bank account are check, credit card, debit card, cash in, ATM withdrawal, direct debit, TD transfer. Examples of payment method for cash account are cash and petty cash. Examples for deposits accounts are by cash, by check, by credit card, and so on. Click on save. See my main bank account is being created. I can drag this put under cash of bank. Yes. And I would like to change the account name for this uh, special account. Let's click on edit account and let's change to public bank per heart. Look at other debtors. It is a normal account. I want to remove this account. I just click on delete account. Yes. And I want to add a special account for data control under current asset. Click on data control. Other debtors. Save. Okay. Similarly to other creditors, remove it and add a creditor control. Other creditors, save. As you can see, I can create more than one debtor or creditor control account. And of course, none of these control accounts should carry any transaction. Click on stock button and I can maintain a set of three stock accounts at one go. I have I already have one so I can just ignore this one. Go to others. Maintain stock value links. You can see the links of a stock accounts. One set of three stock accounts. Retain earning button is used to maintain retain earning or retain profit account. They must have one and only one retained earning special account. I have already had one, so I can add another retained earning special account. The delete account is to delete account that carries no transaction, no balance, no sub account, or no child account, and not being deferred. Let's take a look on the print chart of account. This is used to preview or print chart of accounts. You may set the filter option and click on inquiry to list the result or to preview the chart of account. While you are at preview mode, you may save the chart of account in different format. Account type order is used to rearrange the order of account type. You may use the up and down button to rearrange. Now this arrangement is only for printing chart of account. It will not affect the layout of standard financial reports. That's all for chart of account. Thank you.